This chocolate cake is so moist, extremely chocolatey and super easy to make. And we don't need to have any special equipments or hard to find ingredient to make this chocolate cake. And we can make this chocolate batter in three simple steps. So let's see how to make this easy, moist and decadent chocolate cake. To make this chocolate cake, we'll need some flour, some cocoa powder, some sugar, butter, eggs, some vanilla extract and baking powder and some grated or roughly chopped chocolate. So let's start by chopping some chocolate. And keep it aside and now as the first step to make our cake batter let's whisk together all of those powdered ingredients so add into a bowl some flour cocoa powder and the baking powder and whisk them together so that the baking powder gets evenly distributed in the flour And now as the second step, let's combine all the best of ingredients in another bowl. Add the butter. Make sure the butter is very soft so that it's easy for us to blend them together. And now add in the sugar. Here I've used a soft brown sugar. We can use either white sugar or brown sugar or a mix of both but using brown sugar will give more moistness to our cake and cream them together until they are light and fluffy and now add in the vanilla extract and three eggs we are adding eggs one egg at a time After adding the third egg, you may see the batter gets curdled, but that's okay. That's because of the difference in the proportion of the butter and the liquid ingredients. And it will get resolved when we add flour into this. And now as the third step, let's combine the wet and the dry ingredients together. So add in the flour mix into this and we need to take care not to over mix the batter after adding flour as overworking with the flour can cause gluten to develop which can result in tough and rubbery cake. chopped chocolates and uh, one thing that we need to remember is that most of the baking powder that we use are double acting and so it will instantly get activated when it get into contact with any wet ingredient and so once we prepare the cake batter we need to immediately take it into the oven for baking So transfer the cake batter into a greased baking pan. And now our cake batter is ready to go into the oven. So bake at 350 Fahrenheit preheated oven for 60 to 70 minutes. And you can check the doneness of the cake at around one hour by parking a skewer into the center of the cake. And if it comes out clean, our cake is done. And after baking, we'll get a beautiful loaf of chocolate cake and let the cake cool down for 10 minutes and then demold it from the pan and if you want to top the cake with some chocolate sauce it's so easy to make just pour in some hot heavy cream or whipping cream into the finely chopped chocolate here i've used dark chocolate and mix them together while it's still hot 
and the chocolate will melt in a minute and we'll get a beautiful chocolate sauce. And this chocolate cake is so moist and so chocolatey and I had with me some homemade berry sauce which goes pretty well with this chocolate cake. The sweet and tangy flavor of that berry sauce rightly complement this rich chocolatey flavor. And it's so easy to make this berry sauce. I just boil some water and sugar until it reaches a syrup consistency and then add into this some frozen or fresh berries and wait until the moisture evaporates and it will get thickened to the right consistency. And that's it. I hope you found this chocolate cake recipe easy to make and I hope you will make this at home. And if you like chocolate, then you will love this chocolate cake. And if you like this video, please give your valuable thumbs up and please don't forget to share this recipe with your friends and family who love chocolate. Thank you so much for your love and support and thanks for watching this video. See you next time.